Our Creator created the universe and everything around us. Everything in this universe is governed by divine laws. From gravity to strong nuclear force, everything works according to the laws created by our Creator. Our Creator has also created laws by which human beings are supposed to abide by. These laws are divine laws. But in time, human beings came up with their own laws, some based on divine laws and some based on the norms of their time and surroundings. These human laws are called nation-state laws. Human beings used these laws, specifically nation-state laws, to regulate the society in which they live in. These laws vary a great deal from nation to nation. Sometimes these laws are oppressive to a certain group of people in favor of other groups of people. Murder, invasion of privacy, torture, imprisonment resulted from some of these nation-state laws. Nation-states used these laws in the name of patriotism, security, maintaining way of life, without regards to any divine laws. All humans will face death. All humans will be judged for their deeds. But the judgment will be based on divine laws, not based on nation-state laws. Are you ready to defend yourself based on divine laws? Something we all human beings need to ponder before it's too late. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم In the name of Allah, the entirely merciful, the especially merciful. لا أقسم بيوم القيامة I swear by the day of resurrection. ولا أقسم بالنفس اللوامة and I swear by the reproaching soul to the certainty of resurrection. Does man think that we will not assemble his bones? Yes, we are able even to proportion his fingertips. بَلْ يُرِيدُ الْإِنسَانُ لِيَفْجُرَ أَمَامَهُ But man desires to continue in sin. يَسْأَلُ أَيَّانَ يَوْمُ الْقِيَامَةِ He asks, when is the day of resurrection? فَإِذَا بَرِقَ الْبَصَرُ So when vision is dazzled, وَخَسَفَ الْقَمَرُ And the moon darkens, وَجُمِعَ الشَّمْسُ وَالْقَمَرُ and the sun and the moon are joined. Man will say on that day, where is the place of escape? No, there is no refuge. To your Lord, that day is the place of permanence. يُنَبَّأُ الْإِنسَانُ يَوْمَئِذٍ بِمَا قَدَّمَ وَأَخَّرُ Man will be informed that day of what he sent ahead and kept back. بَلِ الْإِنسَانُ عَلَى نَفْسِهِ بَصِيرَهُ Rather, man against himself will be a witness. وَلَوْ أَلْقَى مَعَاذِيرَهُ Even if he presents his excuses. لا تحرك به لسانك لتعجل به. Move not your tongue with it, O Muhammad, to hasten with recitation of the Quran.
Indeed, upon us is its collection in your heart, and to make possible its recitation. So when we have recited it through Gabriel, then follow its recitation. Then upon us is its clarification to you. No, but you love the immediate. And leave the hereafter. Some faces that day will be radiant. Looking at their Lord. And some faces that day will be contorted. Expecting that there will be done to them something backbreaking. No, when the soul has reached the collarbones. And it is said, who will cure him? And the dying one is certain that it is the time of separation. And the leg is wound about the leg. To your Lord that day will be the procession. And the disbeliever had not believed, nor had he prayed. But instead he denied and turned away. And then he went to his people swaggering in pride. Woe to you and woe. Then woe to you and woe. Does man think that he will be left neglected? Had he not been a sperm from semen emitted? Then he was a clinging clot. And Allah created his form and proportioned him. And made of him two mates, the male and the female. Is not that creator able to give life to the dead?